The Perth Scorchers are on their way home tonight after taking out back-to-back -back Big Bash titles. And while the win will be remembered as one of WA's finest, it came down to the last ball. Here we are. What a finish. The Scorchers tilt at Big Bash history got down to one run off the last ball. The last ball of Aussie speeds to Brett Lee's career. Brett Lee steams into Arafat. It's up there. Arafat hits and he's out. Oh, the Scorchers are home. They've gone back to back. You cannot believe what you're seeing. They stream onto the field. The Scorchers becoming the first team to win back-to-back -back T20 titles. Unbelievable feeling, unbelievable finish. Um, we never like making these things easy for ourselves, but oh, just so happy we've got over the line. There were plenty of stars. Batsmen Sean Marsh and Michael Carberry, bowlers Jason Berendorf and AJ Ty. But nobody more important to the side than veteran Brad Hogg, just one week shy of his 44th birthday. Yet again, the extraordinary athlete played a crucial role in his stage Big Bash success. Down the wing, bowled! Deceived! Beautifully slotted from home. And he's far from finished. He's just about to sign a deal in the super-rich Indian Premier League. It looks like I'm going to the IPL as well, so hopefully I'll get another season or two with the Big Bash here in, in, with the Perth Scorchers. Not bad, considering he retired seven years ago at 37 and then made a spectacular comeback. Over the last four years, I, I don't think I've uh, enjoyed my cricket as much at WA as, as what I have. I don't think I've ever seen a better team atmosphere. Michael Thompson, Nine News.